Hi guys, it's John Owens here from Aussie Brew. Um, just a quick update on my uh, Young's Harvest Mild. Um, the uh, main fermentation is now complete and I'm just taking uh, gravity weed in there and it's uh, uh, still, a, still a tad, uh, yeah probably a bit higher but that's of course because I've added brew enhancer instead of sugar so uh, still fermenting but what I've now done I've added my dry hop this is going to be interesting and what I've done here is added uh, 55 grams of East Kent Goldings and look at that I've used my um, my new Chinese tea percolator first time I've used it I've sanitized it cleaned it etc put the hops in there and now that's gone in to the uh, to the brew and it goes on a little hook there over the side and goes in. Now I can already see that some of the hops in there was um, a bit powdery, the pellets, so we'll have to see whether the uh, the holes in the percolator <coughs> may, may be a bit too large. It was fine mesh but obviously not as fine as a uh, a muslin bag that you can obviously use to do dry hopping. If uh, if I feel that there's too much hop in the brew, then obviously I'll uh, instead of bottle it straight from the uh, this FV, I'll have to uh, do um, you know I'll have to siphon it over to a secondary and, and bottle it from there. But it's smelling great. Uh, East Kent Goldings, along with Fuggles, are a good hop, I believe, to uh, dry hop. Uh, dark mild kit so I'm very much looking forward to it uh, on another note I'd like to thank uh, Brewmaster Ben for a beer mail which I received this morning five lovely looking beers so what I'll do is I'll um, I'll do uh, a mini series of me waffling on on my homebrew Wednesdays and, and, and have one of Ben's beers during those so thanks very much for that Ben uh, very very Christmassy of you and, uh, and there we go so a quick update the uh, Harvest Mild, Young's Harvest Mild, um, dry hopped now with uh, 55 grams of East Kent Goldings. Cheers, thank you very much guys, bye bye.